Alright guys, so I just got the drive in. I just got the drive in and I've got the old drive in my external SATA mobile HHD kit so I can boot from it so I can uh, make this other uh, drive Mac friendly and I put this cool sticker oh shit on the back that I wanted to show you it says Speed Demon and it is a sweet sticker Speed Demon Solid State Drive Intel blah 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 so I put that there just in case anybody wants to like try me and one time in one of my videos somebody asked they were like uh, they were like itchy why is it that your keyboard looks so ratty it's not my keyboard it's the cover and it's to keep my keys pressed in uh, just in case I decide to sell so I'm going to power this guy on and hold down the option key so that I can boot from my external drive here and then I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna reform and I'm gonna format this other drive and we're going to go from there so I've gotten into this my hard drive and uh, it's coming externally right now and I'm going in and I'm going to go to this particular uh, hard drive here which is the new solid state that I insta installed and I am going to do a erase and I'm going to format as a Mac OS journal and I'm going to call this one what do I want to call this one I call, my, I, I call all my hard drives from Mac the juice box but this one will be juice box SSD and we're going to go through the song and dance and make it so that it will accept what I need it to accept and that's it it is it is pretty much done so I'm going to go here and make sure that I check it and make sure that I'm that it's got the Mac OS journal and if you look here you probably can't see it but it, it but it says uh, the Mac OS extended journal that's what we want so now I can take every well that's actually that's the juice box we don't want that one we know that was a Mac OS journal I need to make sure that my SSD says it so we're going to get info and it says it Mac OS extended journal and I got 119 gigabytes beautiful so I'm going to go in and I'm going to eject everything and I'm going to boot from, you guessed it, uh, Lion. So I will show you, all I'm going to do at this point is pop in a Lion disc and that's going to be it. And once it's finished doing this thing, I'll be back to talk about speed and all that other stuff. Then I will try the trim uh, hack. Stand by. Okay guys, I basically just popped in my copy of OS Line that I burned and um, OS X Line, excuse me, and I just hold, held down the option key and the little OS X disk boot popped up on the screen and it's going to do its thing to this solid state hard drive um, at which point I will start going in and turning off sleep mode and some of those other uh, things that I do not need. So, yeah, really exciting. Alright guys, so check it out. I have enabled trim mode on my Intel 320 series SSD hard drive. And I just wanted to show you guys. I'm going to go to about this Mac and get more info. And I'm going to go to a system report here. And I'm going to go down to serial ATA. And if you look, it shows the Intel. Let me zoom in for you so you can actually see what I am trying to show you oh. back up back up just a half so y'all can see I'm trying to show you that ah. yeah if you back up if you look here it's got the Intel drive which is what we're talking about it's 120 gig capacity 
and if you look here where it says trim support it says yes and that's what it's supposed to say um, that just means that I've enabled trim support and that everything's verified and we are good to go okay guys I just showed you the trim support being enabled now I want to show you a boot up test to see how long this thing takes to boot up it used to take close to a minute to boot up um, and that was with that 500 gig Western Digital let's see what it does here with this solid state drive and we're ready and go hopefully we can beat that time by a lot which is important to me oh, got me a message while I'm doing this awesome about 24 seconds and uh, right at 25 so we're going to say 25 because I had to have my reaction time put in there but it went from about 40 from about 47 48 to 25 which is pretty good. I'm happy with that. Um, as compared, now there's others on YouTube whose times have gotten faster even than that. Depends on the drive you went with. I'm happy with that time. That's pretty quick. That's less than 30 seconds to power up and, you know, be off and running. Um, let's look at, let's look at application real quick and see if there's any difference there. Let me come over to you guys. Um, let's go to Safari. When everything looks to be loading pretty good, pretty pretty fast. Um, let's go to YouTube and see what we got there. And this is the new look YouTube. Uh, I will be doing a video on that soon, so just stand by. But we'll be looking at it. Let's just pick a let's pick a video to watch. Oh, let's look at one of my videos. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Let's see. Let's look at this one. Let's see how fast it loads up. And what up, YouTube? It's me. Just give you a quick update about this controller. Oh, that's shit, it's that's fine. up for grabs. As you can see, I have cleaned it up quite nicely. Um, the dirt is all gone, and the battery's tested. Is ready for the road, and. Uh, there's an on-off switch on the back, like you guys know. That's got the uh, yellow LED. There it is. In it. Um, every, uh, that loaded up pretty fast. I have to say, I'm very pleased with that. Um, I've got a few more programs I need to load onto this thing, and hopefully, I'll keep. Uh, I'll be able to deal with this 120 gigs only. And um, what I'll be doing as a solution for my editing is I'm going to be using uh, the East SATA. Uh, two terabyte drive, probably uh, Lacey. I'm not sure yet, but I'm going to use an eSATA um, and I'm going to use my express card slot for that. So that's what I'll be using right now. Hopefully, that'll work. But yeah, um, so far, so good. Looks like this is going to be interesting. That's all I got. I'm going to load up a couple of different things, get this thing back to where I can actually use it uh, with what I have to do every day. That's it. I'm out. Peace.